This superstar is coming in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen when the excitement wears off and he comes to realize he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off? All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. And then there is the Brock Lesnar, a superstar seemingly built to destroy and conquer anyone who steps foot in his path. Yeah, I honestly can't imagine standing across the ring from Lesnar and not playing the greatest hits of all the battles he's won. All the superstars he's so emphatically dominated on a loop in your brain. The man definitely has a well-deserved reputation. A neck breaker. Stiff kick. He's got the shoulders down. And bypasses the pinfall. He is too fresh to have been kept down there. Caught with a lariat. Moved at the right time. Release German. And here we go now. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. German suplex. Lesnar with a well-timed shot. Well, it's the age-old question. What do you do to stop Brock Lesnar? Well, if this guy figures it out, I sure hope he tells me. Frankly, Lesnar's so different, I'd say you might as well try anything and just see what works. Worst case, you go out swinging. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. This match grinded him down a little. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Out into the quick cover. He hasn't done nearly enough to get the pin yet. I thought he might have had him there, but it's early. Ooh, bullseye. Oh, walloped by a huge club. Stomping down. He's able to fend off the attack. Suplex City. Pop you. And he goes for the pin. It's over. All in a night's work. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one-sided as it gets.